YouTube channel again so guys in this video we will see how to fix the Owlet app not reading so guys if you facing this issue so you are not alone many have user having this issue and in this video we will see how to fix this issue so guys for uh, make its workable first of all check the base station light so first of all verify that the small screen light on the bait button of the base station is light up if it is not you can review the base station setup and ensure it's pro properly connected for checking this you can following this step first of all baseline device can communicate with the smart shock and send the notification to the outlet app then look of the small indicator lights uh, that says Wi-Fi on the bottom of the base stations then you can verify the green light after green light you can it's indicate the base station is powered on and connected to the smart shock okay if the green light is not eliminated so you can review the base station setup and ensure it will be properly connected okay and you also perform a powerful cycle of the base station by unplugging it for the three minutes and unplugging it back to see if the light comes on okay then the, we have the second step so guys second step is plug in and rest the sensor so unplug the base station can reset the sensor so you can find the specified step of the outlet options and you can plug in the rest outlet smart shock and sensor you can follow the general steps for unplugging the base station you can disconnect the base station from the power and press and hold the base station button while plugging the base station back in then light rack draw the dome part of the sensor across the top of the base station to reset the sensor and press and hold the steam shock base station button while plugging the base station then hold the power button on the bottom of the charge for two seconds and the melian on the charger to reset the sensors then we have the third option so guys third option is check your wi-fi connections so guys verify your base station is successfully connected with your wi-fi and ensure that your outlet smart shock is connected to the compatibilities wi-fi network so you can check your wi-fi frequency and split your network and adjust your bandwidth okay if you performing this task and you're still having the error so you need to update your phone software and the app version okay so make sure your phone is up to date additionally ensure that you are using the latest outlet care app okay for if you want to update your ios so you can for iphone and ipad you can go to the setting of the home screen and scroll down and select the journal then tab on the about and see the any software is available of not if it is available so you can download and install now guys we have the another step so guys another step for the android app android devices on the another devices you can open the settings app and scroll and select about phone and about devices and look for the android version or software information to find the current software version for updating the ios so guys next step is updating the outlet apps in the ios for updating the io io outlet so you can open the app app store on your browser or ipad and then tab on your profile icon in the right corner and scroll down to review and pending any update is release notes then you after if any update is available so you can download and install them for android user you can perform these steps now guys we have the fifth option so guys fifth option is perform a power cycle to fix the outlet app not working so you reading so you can perform these step so performing a powerful cycle step of the base station you can unplug it for the three minutes and plug it back into the again and specify reset instruction can found an outlet support page for your smart shocks version okay then we have the sixth option so guys sixth option is contact with the outlet support so guys if you performing all the steps and you do not find any solution and you are stuck in the same problem so guys you need to connect with the support team they will be provide a better solution and troubleshooting step of your problem so guys thank you and have a nice day and subscribe our youtube channel for the further information